Hey guys, what's going on? Shabby Doo here, and today we're jumping into another Shabby Automation with Autonauts. And what we're going to start off with here is I'm going to show you what I've done in the meantime. Uh, also, don't forget to hit subscribe, guys. Hit subscribe below so you can see our sweet daily content every single day at 9.15 Eastern. Don't forget to hit like so I know you're loving this series. But other, like I said, so what I did here is I added another bot here for research. I'm creating another research station here, which I need to go add the rocks to myself. And I had just let this run a bit, so I got all the tier 1 research out of the way. And now what I want to do real quick is we're going to update this just a little bit further. So let's move you over here. And because I'm pretty sure these things can be working off. Yeah, they work off the same thing. So what I want to do is take Dr. Oz. Stop you for a second. Record. And I want you to come over here. I want you to go to this one. Oops. Every time. Oh, it's not going to let me. I probably need to put the stick in first. Hold on. Let me grab a stick. Put that in here. Oh, it's not upgraded. Duh. I forgot. This is a level two, so we got to make this level two as well. Stand by. So we'll do this automatically. So we'll bring this right back down here to my blueprint area. So we'll let my robots here take care of this. I just need to do the stone myself. We'll get a robot for stone later. All the stuff I've been working on now that I need only has these every now and then. So we'll grab this. So that'll be all set here. Thank you. Put that one here. All right, now we'll try this again. Let me go pick up one of these real quick. All right now, Dr. Oz, record. Go here. I must need the stick. Oh, I don't have anything in my hand. Okay, it needs the stick. Pause. Uh, da -da -da. Where's the stick? There it is. Set it up. Yep, so 120, 120. Perfect. All right, now we can do this. So it does need to stick in there again, which is fine. It makes sense. All right, record. Now go drop this in. I always hit left click instead of right click. I don't know why. Drop that in there. There we go. Move to add to until hands are empty. All right. So because so what's that's going to do is that's going to help efficiency because if we watch here, watch how long it takes. One. Two, three, and you can't use it at the same time someone else is using it. So like if I come over here, drop mine in real quick. Wait for him to come back and I'll drop another one and we'll notice he's not going to be able to drop anything in. See, now he's sitting there and waiting. So and that's what happens when both of them are using the same one. So having two of these going at the same time is very helpful. Now we're gonna further upgrade this as well. So what we're gonna do while those guys are working, gonna drop a couple of those bad boys down here. Uh, I'm gonna grab one of these real quick, just to throw it in here, just to set it up. Awesome. So that leads us to the second thing I did. We got the upgrade research for the MK1 bots. I accidentally labeled them, them wrong, but they're MK1. So, I'm, I'm not going to build a lot of these because there's a big dis there's only a small distinction between the MK0, which is these guys, and the MK1s, which are these guys. The big jump is with the MK2. And honestly, I don't think I've ever made MK2 robots myself. I don't think I never I ever made it that far. So we'll figure that out as we go. But what I did is I have some MK1s here making a making a head, so a plank and a tree, and I have them set to make 10 at a time, so I just play them when I want them to. A body, two planks and a pole. And then you need an MK1 because you need the up the memory upgrade in order to make this one work to make a body. So you need a log, a plank, and a pole. And then same thing with this one. He then comes out, grabs the head, stores it, grabs the body, stores it. So I'll even show the code. 
grabs the head, stores it, because they have a they have a backpack item like we do, unlike the MK0. Then he's gonna go find the body. Then he's gonna add it to here. Then he's gonna retrieve the head, add it here, find the legs, come back and add it, and then the robot's built. Because we have two kilobytes free, and he has the memory upgrade, which is also made at the basic workbot. So right here, memory upgrade gives a little bit more instructions. You can also do sensor upgrade to increase the search range. Uh, bot power, hold more items. Speed boost. And then we've got uh, bot, bots, or crude bot energy upgrade, so the batteries last long. And then a backpack, store one more item. As you can see, I've got the backpack on right here. And now I can have two items in my backpack. All right, so that was the other thing we upgraded right there. So let's grab you. You are gonna be the Wove Gathering. I want you to come over here. I want you to find Wove, I don't even care where it is. Anywhere in there. Do that, and then I want you to store it here. Until your hands are empty, until your hands are full. Skip it if there's nothing in the area. And then do all that forever. All right. And then we're gonna fix our bot. So Dr. Phil and Dr. Oz here, gonna take a break in a second. All right, record. Uh, actually, hold on, record. I think I have enough, let me see. Oh, I'm already standing on it. Until hands are full. I think if I have it do this, they'll take from the storage first, and then if they can't take anything because there's nothing in the storage, then they'll go look on the ground for it, and then they'll go. Yeah, and it skips right down. Perfect. So that's what I want with those guys, because that way, let's just say this is full. Or or if this is empty, I should say, sorry. If this is empty, they'll take from the ground if there's some on the ground, so they'll still keep moving. So it's kind of like a little, uh, just a little, uh, not a pause in the process, but like a little upgrade to help out. So let's see. Same thing, do that. And then I want you to come. No, I think I want to do it the other way around. I want them to search the ground first. Yeah, I want them to search the ground first. Then if they find nothing, go to the storage and then go. No, no, I want it this way. Because theoretically there should be nothing on the ground, really. It should all be in the storage. You know what, we're gonna build him. Can these bots have two upgrades? No, yes, they can have two upgrades. So let's go over here. I'm gonna build the shoes and the arm upgrade. So so I need, a, I need two crude gears and a pole and six crude gears. So we're gonna make some crude gears real quick. So crude gears are one plank. See, now I can store two in my backpack. Remember, it has to be the same item. Oops. So now I can make all of these at once. I'm trying to think if I did anything else. Really, it was just a lot of uh, sitting and waiting. Some, my, oops, some minor upgrades. Um, oh, that's what I did. So we talked about the flail before. So I did create a work bot for this workstation here to cr to make flails. It takes two sticks and it's the MK1 bot because a MK2 or an MK1 bot are perfect for doing these because they can make it and store it all in one go. So then you can set them up to do it until the storage is full right here. And then he'll just sit around and wait until he's got one in his hand. Once they come and take this crude flail, they'll keep moving around. Let's see. It looks like we're actually doing really good here. Let's do this. 
Oh, there's a stick in the way. We'll do that after. I'm going to set this up so that there's another secondary storage. Get a lot of those ready to go. And then what I also have is we have a bot with a mallet. I wonder where he is. Tree whacker. There he is. So he's got a mallet here, and he's just going to go around and whack trees until the stick storage is full. Because that's his main purpose. The tree seeds are always full now, so he'll go around and do with that. Because with the whacking, we'll get tree seeds and sticks. So, so that's why I have it set for when that's full. Alright, so let's go over here now. We'll get our pole. So here's our power up output. Then get these. Oh, wait, no. Sorry. Cancel that. Change it to shoes. One more pole. Excellent. I'm trying to think. Do we need anything being made? I, I can use some more pallets. Maybe a couple more boxes. But we'll get a... Uh, Two barrels and a stack of silos ready as well, just because we're get we're full on mats here pretty much. So I want to make sure we keep everything moving. And we're gonna optimize this too a bit later. All right, so now I've got shoes and a power upgrade. Pause for a second. Come here. All right. Then if you control right click on them, you'll automatically do the upgrades. So you don't have to you don't have to go into them. Oops. Open up the trade menu and then drag them over. So now you can see they have he has the arm and the speed boost. So now he can hold five things. All right. Go ahead. All right. Storage is decent. Just means they're pumping out WUV pretty quickly here. So we are going to need to upgrade these guys to tier two soon. So actually what we're also going to do. One, two, three, four, five, six of those. So that'll take a bit for our one logger to do, but we're not in a rush, so he can just take his time with that. All right, so now we've got this a little more optimized, which is great. So now what we're gonna do is, I'm gonna show you how to use these signs. It's not just a sign to tell you how to subscribe. We're actually gonna utilize this very well. So let me click, let me grab this real quick. So if we go into it and do the size here, you can see it's a 17 by 17 area for this sign which is the same search radius as an MK1 robot, but it's bigger than an MK0, right? So we're gonna turn this into the sign for our charge bots. So what I wanna do here, minimize all these. Charge bots, I want you all to stop and come here. And actually what I wanna do as well I need to build a What's it called? A crude data storage. So I need two planks, poles, and tree seeds. Because what this does, it'll copy a code and let us download it straight to a robot. So it's helpful for just like making multiple of the same types of robots without having to redo all the instructions again. So let me grab that. I gotta remember how this thing works, but that's fine. All right, and I'm gonna grab you. So you're gonna be our flag runner. You'll be the electric slide. And actually stop for a second. Oh, uh, come here though. 
So he's going to hold that sign, okay? So what's going to happen, because he's holding it, that zone's going to keep moving with him now, right? So I'm just going to set him up. I'm going to record. I want him... I want him to move over here. I then want you to move over here. I want you to move over here. I want you to move over here. Over here. Over here. And then that'll be it. Oops. Well, stop. Record. Do forever. Go. So you can see he's going to move around. If I could click on that sign. I don't know if I can just click the sign directly. Probably not. I'm going to go charge these robots myself real quick. Actually, don't care about them. I wish I could click the sign to show you. Can't, though. It's okay. So, but that means that rate, that zone is moving with him. So now what we're going to do is we're going to have ChargeBot 1 over here. So I want you to find, oops, record. This select structure. Oh, come on. I gotta remember how to do this. Hold on. Uh, look at area. Nope. Maybe this isn't the, the thing I can do it with. Maybe it has to be on the ground. Hold on a second. Uh, let's see, back up for a sec. You, pause or stop. Drop what you're using. Let me grab it real quick. Okay. So, charge bot zero. Record. Ah, there we go. It has to be on the ground, so... If I select structure instead... I can click on this. Okay. Same thing here. Perfect. So now he'll f he'll follow him around and check for bots in that area. So now we need all of our other charge bots here. So that was charge bot two. I need charge bot one. Record. Here. I don't think I did that right. Hold on. Do that. Check off. Do the... Do this. Check off. Perfect. Actually, I don't need... I don't need this to be redundant anymore. There we go. So, that's fine. We can do the same here. And then charge bot three. Oh, he's dead. Oh, there we go. Record. And then this, this, this. Check it. Play it. All right. So now. Let me pick this up. Give that back to you. Oopsies. And hit play. See, and he picked up because the zone moved, so he's like, oh no, Feedy's needs to be re recharged. So now everyone will start getting recharged. It's just going to be a mess right now because everything's dead because I waited so long to get this ready. But that's okay. I'll just give them all a hand real quick. Actually, I didn't need the, uh, this, but what I'm gonna do... Do I actually have... I don't think I have any regular bots that aren't doing anything right now. No, I don't. Let's 
See? Charge bots coming in. See, it's just, it just doesn't work out well when everything dies at once. But when you actually have more charge bots in the team, it works amazingly. What's your issue? Are you doing something? Let's see. Now you can see how the zone's moving. So now I can get two teams of this going eventually at some point. And have them working in like a counter rotation. And then I'll have two charge bots kind of going around one clockwise, one counterclockwise in my areas. Then all we need to do is move him around if we need to change it rather than change every other bot, which is great. So we'll put electric slide up here with all his charging buddies. Love gathering. I'll put him on the research team. All right. So that is our our love generation upgrade. That's our charging upgrade. I want to upgrade our planks a little bit more too. So you stop for a second. Let's see. I don't know. I don't actually remember how to use this. So do it this way. Plank crafter. Okay. And then I'm going to go here. Click, right click. Oops. Ah, so. Plank crafting. You are gonna just stop, record. Oh no, not pull. Plank. You stop, record, trash all that. I want you to go here. I want you to do this until your hands are full. Um, we're gonna make this area bigger. Right here, fine. Drop that. There. Happy? I want you to find any planks, because I like to throw planks on the ground, so and I want you to find them. Find any planks around here. Pick them up until your hands are full, and then bring them to storage. And do that until your hands are empty, and then repeat that forever. So, I want him to just be going and looking for them. Now, I want you to go. Actually, stop for a second. Uh, record. I want you to... Yep, take... Boop, boop. I want you to move a log, take a log, move chop. Boop. I want you to keep doing that forever. I wonder if he can hold two. Let's find out here, so. I'm gonna set up a bot eventually. What are you, pole crafter? Oh, sorry. Keep going. The poles are fine because we use so little of them. Planks, I want to speed them up a bit. I want one guy just crafting and I want another guy just using them. Actually, we're going to just fix his radius a bit here, too. Just because he doesn't... I don't need all this space down here. I was just doing that to prove a point. It's just going to be better off if I have him walking back and forth up here, because... So. Oh, he needs to come down a little bit here. Whoops. You start up. Electric slide. Stop. Record. I want you to go here. To here. To here. To here. To here. Alright, now go. There we go. That'll just make his area a little better.
Are all my charge bots dead? I got charge bot one right here. Need to upgrade the team a bit. Those MK0 bots are slacking off. It's fine though. So now I want to do a little more berry storage as well. Oh, let's grab all these so they finish crafting. Excellent. I do want more of these, though. There we go. Um, delete that one, though. Okay. So what I also want to do is... BD... No, no, sorry. Berry transport. Stop. Record. Take from there. Uh, let me take from here real quick. All right. Three seed storage. What did I just do? Move there. Add there. Oops. Put it down here. There you go. Now if this is full, he'll start putting some over here as well. And actually, I'm going to copy his code. We're going to upgrade him into, uh, into a new robot over here. Do you do anything? Oh, there's a lot of them just sitting over here. Okay. So you are going to be the new berry transport. Because I'm going to give him a hand upgrade and a feed upgrade as well. Just like we did with the other robot for Wub Transportation. Alright, so I built some more upgrades here. And I also set up a little bot right here real quick to start building some crude gears for me. They make them a lot faster than I do. And I have him set up right now just to do it until this is full. So it's full now, so he'll stop. So, but it doesn't bother me to have a little bit of extra here. So I just set it up real quick, like I wasn't making a full process, so. But what I do need to do is, I don't know what happened. I used to have an axe crafter, a shovel crafter, and a pick crafter, and I don't see any of those three bots anymore. No idea where they went or what happened to them. And also, why all my... And why all the bots are dying. I need more charge bots, apparently. Look at this. It's a mess. It's a mess. Let's go fix this real quick, and then I'll add some more charge bots to the team as well. I got, like, charge bot one right here. All right. So, but uh, with that, I need you. Very transport to stop. Stop and come here. Go install that on you, and then install. Whoops. There we go. Go ahead. So now he just moves faster, and he can hold more in his hands. So he's just going to be a little bit more effective. All right, so now I need more shovels and axes, so we're going to get those crafting. So with that, we're going to grab our new bots because they have much better memory here. So this will be our axe crafter. So for an axe, he's just going to need a stick and a stone. So go grab a stick, store it, grab a stone. Do that. Grab it. That's shovels. Put it in there. And now do it forever. Just fits. Excellent. 
Go. So now we'll do the same thing for one of you guys. We'll take 1008, MK18. You are going to be the shovel crafter. And you're going to go grab a stick. Store it, grab a rock, go here, do that. Do that, come over here, drop it in here. And do it forever. And then it'll automatically stop. I don't have to set up a... I don't actually have to set it up to do it like if this is full because he'll make the the 11th one and then he'll just sit here and wait until this is has a spot open. Then he'll deposit it and then move back and make a new one. Okay. So, and then because I did that, we don't need some of these guys in here. We don't need our shovel gatherer. So you're going to be charge bot four. Put you up here. Uh, same with tool gathering. You'll become you'll become charge bot five. You'll go, whoops, you'll come up here. And, let's see, body, flail, leg, leg, gather, gather, crafting. Crafter, crafter, okay. So that's fine. Double crafter will come up here now. So. Oh, charge bot three is not even moving. Neither is charge bot two. Well, that would explain why a lot of this isn't working well. I'm going to come over here real quick. <laughs> you start working. Charge bot three. I want you to come to me. I want four over here, and I want five over here. Drop that. Oops. So, charge bot three. Go ahead. Charge bot four, go ahead. Charge bot five, go ahead. There we go. Now we've got some more charge bots on the on the field. Oh good, these are done as well. Let's just throw these into our storage. Beautiful stuff. See, our flail crafter just immediately dropped one in there. Look at this. Look at all these flails just hanging out. It's probably because of me. I. It's probably me that put them there. No doubt. Alright, so we've got berry gathering a little slow here. So we'll upgrade those to MK1 bots as well. And we'll give them the the extra upgrades to move faster and hold more just because it works great for gathering and then what else do we need to work on here i think what we need is we're gonna then start to upgrade this to tier two. Ooh, actually we need a research starting for one because they're doing nothing um yep we'll do that real quick i'll make my own head let's see a tree seed and a plank i need two of them so let me grab that and two planks Here we go. We'll see how, how well our charge bots work now. All right, so... All right, these robots are in my way. Wait. What, what is... What is my issue here? You are completely in my way. Yeah, you know, all that. Record. Then move here. Uh, no. Move. Move here.
There we go. Just so he's out of my way. So I could have sworn I made two heads, though. Did I? Maybe not. Losing my mind here, I guess. Losing my mind. Alright, one head, two heads. Let's go do this. But why aren't you guys going? I did I not hit play? Oh, it's my forever loop. Stop. There we go. Gotta turn that off. Make sure my other charge bots don't have that. He doesn't. He does. Take that off. There we go. Take that off. Okay. There we go. It's it's because it you only use those within a separate forever loop because if you have it to skip because it doesn't find anything, the bot turns off because do this forever unless you can't do anything. And then it's like, okay, well now I'm doing nothing and nothing's telling me to re-loop back to the top to a different forever loop, so it just stops. That was my issue there. That's being recharged. Look at this. Oh. Wait, two heads? Drop that there. Drop this here. There we go. Like, wait a second, why is this so f Why are my hands full? Help these guys out real quick. So yeah, so there we go. So we got that upgrade. We've got our wub being put to use now. So yeah, the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to make some MK1 bots to uh, start putting this up, which means I'll make some a couple of these upgrades here. And then we'll be working on, in the next episode, what do we need? We need food. So we need tier two food. So we'll start putting these mixing pots down here, right? So I'll probably put them right, right here is probably fine. Two. No, I don't like that spot. Maybe I'll do it right here. And then there. Get this out of my way. I don't know if we're going to need all four of these. Maybe we only need two, so we'll figure that out. But what we're going to need to make here... So let's see. So this is our first step. So watery porridge... I don't know. I don't think that's an actual food. So actual foods that we can make here... Are... Well... Spiced berries, so four berries and some weeds. So we need to get a weed farm going. And then we can start making these next level foods. Also, maybe we'll f get a uh, fishery going as well. That might be very handy. Yeah, so that's the next step. So we need to build a weed farm. Maybe we'll just do that right here. Get some, get a nice weed farm going. Get real dank up there. And then we'll start working on... We'll put down all of our huts, put our people in the huts, and then we'll have a tier two area. So we'll stock up on food. So I will say... Right here. That'll be where our tier two food goes for these guys here. All right, cool. Yeah, so that's what we're going to do there. So, and we'll call it quits. Yeah. Yeah, no, that's that's plenty. Everyone's head's probably hurting just like mine right now. And if it's not, well, you're all smarter than me. Because my head hurts when I play this game because I'm always... I'm trying to stay a thousand steps ahead here, but I can really only stay three steps ahead until something goes wrong. And I'm like, okay, well, now what do I do? Look at all these logs. Where are my logs going? Where are my logs going? Is it just from when I built those huts? No. Oh, I know. Look at all these extra planks sitting here. So let's do this here. Let's uh, real quick fix our bo plank bot. Do this. Pause. So you are going to do this until... 
Oops. Okay. Didn't, didn't do it until this is full. And repeat forever. Okay. There we go. Just because, look, we got we got a we got a ton of planks here. That's where all the wood's going, which is great. I need planks. We're gonna need a ton of them, so that's perfect, anyways. But yeah, guys, as usual, if you're liking the auto not series, hit that like button down below. Let's see how the shabby automation is going. If you can help me not make it shabby and make this great, let me know down below as well. And otherwise, don't forget to hit subscribe so you can see the sweet content that comes out every day, 9:15 Eastern time. And as usual, I hope the rest of your day is not too shabby.